Hi and welcome, welcome, welcome to another live. پریا خواص هستم. I hope you're doing well as usual. امیدوارم که حالتون مثل همیشه عالی باشه. We are live again. دوباره لایف هستیم و امشب هم پنج تا کلمه دیگر رو داریم که روشون کار بکنیم. We have five more words to talk about. Let's go for our first word for tonight. بریم سراغ کلمه اول امشب. The first word for tonight, as you can see it, is coincidence. Coincidence. Repeat after me. Coincidence. Coincidence یعنی تصادف یعنی یه چیزی نه که تصادف ماشین و اینا ها یعنی مثلا اتفاقی اتفاقی یه چیزی مثلا اتفاق میفته یه دفعه but you, you, you didn't expect it to happen but it happens you know it's coincidence یعنی تصادفی تصادفن we have uh, some structures let's say not the structures مثلا یه دونه ایز ساختار خوشگل داریم what a coincidence چه تصادفی Listen to this example. مثلا میگیم که we sat down right in front of each other in the train. What a coincidence. <laughs> میگیم ما نشستیم روبروی درست روبروی هم توی قطار. What a coincidence. چه تصادفی. So repeat after me. What a coincidence. <gasps> what a coincidence. Yeah, what a coincidence. پس میتونی اینجوری استفاده بکنی تو این what a coincidence توی این مکالمه میتونی استفاده بکنی or with by for example by coincidence یعنی به صورت تصادفی یا تصادفن for example listen to this example and then I will listen to yours okay مثلا می که by coincidence every man in the room was named Ali for example میگه by coincidence یعنی به بخ... صورت کاملا تصادفی تصادفن every man in the room was named علی <laughs> هر مردی که تو اون اتاق بود اسمش علی بود by coincidence what a coincidence چه تصادفی we met each other last night in Paris what a coincidence ما هم دیگر تو پاریس دیدیم دیشب چه اتفاقی چه تصادفی Okay, so our first word was, you tell me. Bravo, coincidence. Can we turn your biggie? My son was speaking it. خیلی استفاده میشه. Ah, what a coincidence. So the word is coincidence. Bravo, coincidence. Now it's time to go for the second word. بیم سراغ کلمه دوم امشب. کلمه دوم امشب رو as you can see right over there is profound I love this word اینو همه جا میتونی استفاده کنی say it profound profound <laughs> profound یعنی عمیق strong for example profound influence تأثیر عمیق profound knowledge دانش عمیق profound means deep strong خو so say it one more time profound one more time profound perfect it's an adjective یک صفت profound حالا یه توی مثال بیشتر متوجه میشی for example the speech had a profound influence on her یعنی اون سخنرانی the speech had a profound influence on her یک تأثیر عمیقی جرفی روی اون دختره داشت so the speech had a profound influence on her profound influence profound effect تأثیر profound عمیق Or, or for example, another, se- another sentence. He has a profound understanding of the problem. یک درک عمیقی از مشکل داره، از اون مسئله داره. So, he has a profound understanding of the issue or of the problem. Look, 
profound understanding, profound knowledge. درک عمیق, understanding, درک عمیق, profound perception, دید عمیق. You can use it in a, you know, دیشب گفتم کلمه perception رو. Okay, bravo, well done. So one more time, repeat after me. Profound. Deep, strong. یعنی عمیق, جرف. همچین اه. حالا کلمه بعدی ما, which is our third word, is totally the opposite of profound. برعکس پروفاونده یعنی سطحی یعنی something which is not very, like that serious or deep خب چیزی که سطحیه نه مهمه نه مثلا um, profound نیست عمیق نیست listen to the examples you will understand اگزامپل های انتخاب کردم که قیقا تو جای مختلف متوجه میشی for example she survived with only soup آه کلمه رو نگفتی کلمه سو... <laughs> superficial یعنی سطحی repeat after me superficial superficial well done so superficial یعنی ام... سطحی خوب hello listen she survived with only superficial cuts and bruises یعنی دختره نجات پیدا کرد فقط با یه مقداری کات یعنی زخمای و یه زخمای و یه سیاهی کبودی هایی که خفیف و سطحی بود. Superficial cuts. Only uh, superficial cuts and bruises. Yeah. So she survived though. <laughs> نجات پیدا کرد. So superficial. Say it again. Superficial. Bravo. Superficial. It's a very important word. دقیقا مخالف profound هست. So profound, superficial. Superficial, profound. Yay! <laughs> or in another example. توی مثال دیگه بعد مثال شما. He's fun to be with. این پسر خیلی فانه. Okay. He's fun to be with. باش خوش میگذره. But he's very superficial. پس میتونی برای آدم هم استفاده کنی. ولی خیلی سطحیه. So, کلمه superficial رو هم داشتیم. The third word. Let's go for our fourth word for tonight. کلمه چهارم امشب ما هست. Authentic. Repeat after me. Authentic. Authentic. It's an adjective. یک صفته. Authenticity is the noun. Authentic یعنی something which is not fake. Original, اصیل, اصل چیزی که فیک نیست Real, واقعیه For example, an authentic work by Picasso یک کار واقعی, یک اثر اورجینال از پیکاسو An authentic work by Picasso Look, so authentic means real, which is not fake Say it, authentic Bravo, great, authentic, valid, you can say, bravo, or authenticity is the noun, یک اسم, یعنی اسم همون authentic هست, repeat after me, authenticity, authenticity, you have it there, داری شونجا, یعنی, یعنی همون دقیقا اسم همونه دیگه, مثلا واقعیت یک چیزی, یا uh, اصیل بودن یک چیزی مثلا listen to the example they approved the authenticity of Picasso's masterpiece یعنی تایید کردن they confirmed or approved the authenticity of Picasso's masterpiece یعنی واقعیت اورجینال بودن کار پیکاسو رو اونا تایید کردن گفتن آقا این اثر اورجیناله original it is original it is authentic so authenticity you can say that yeah it's a very useful word yeah so authentic means not fake bravo let's go for our last word for tonight which is tranquil tranquil begu tranquil tranquil it's the adjective means peaceful calm tranquil Tranquility is 
the uh, the noun يعني أورامش tranquility. So tranquil كي يبارد يقولوا tranquil يعني peaceful calm. Okay, let's make a sentence with it. مثلاً he lives in a tranquil village. توي دونه village يا روستاي را آروم و calm و peaceful زندگی میکنه. So he lives in a tranquil village. Tranquil. خو tranquil. آروم calm peaceful. با صلح و آرامش. And tranquility is the noun. اسمش میشه tranquility. یه بار بعد از من بگو tranquility. خوب. For example, I love the tranquility of the countryside. من آشق آرامش countryside. یعنی بیرون از شهر هستم. I love the tranquility of the countryside. Yes. Love the tranquility of the countryside. All right, so guys, well done. We learned five more words tonight. Let's have a short review on them. Let's have a short review on them. The first one of us was the first one of us. The first one of us was... You tell me. Coincidence. Bravo. Coincidence means the coincidence. It means the coincidence that you have and you didn't expect it. So... You say, for example, what a coincidence! چه تصادفی! I met him! دیدمش! Like that. Or, کلمه دوم امشب What was the word? Profound. Profound is an adjective. یک صفته به معنی امیغ. Strong. جرف. For example, profound knowledge. Profound understanding. درک امیغ. دانش امیغ. دقیقا مخالفش کلمه سومه which is superficial repeat after me superficial superficial یعنی سطحی دقیقا برعکس عمیق something which is not عمیق <laughs> something which is not profound we say superficial for example he has a superficial character یک کاراکتر سطحی داره یعنی یه عمیق نیست He's fun to be with or she's fun to be with. خیلی باش خوش میذاره. But unfortunately, she or he is very superficial. You can say that. خیلی superficial است هیه. به این سراغی کلمه چهارم. Authentic. Say it. Authentic. Authentic means real. Something which is original. Original. واقعی. اصل. Authentic. And the last word, what was it? Tranquil, bravo. Tranquil, which is peaceful, calm. Tranquil, tranquil, bravo. So you learned actually uh, five more words tonight. Pancha kalamaru yad gerechtin. If you want to learn Join and enjoy. هر شب می‌بینم از ساعت یازده شب به وقت ایران. And of course, تا یک ماه. No. After that, I have another plan for you. Mwah. 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 Mw